Hey bot builders, I'm Gordy from BotPress. Do you love this little full screen chat interface that you get when you publish your bot? Again, this is the one that happens when you publish your bot and then get the shareable link. It's a great full screen chat interface, but what if you want this on your own website? So you can give people a link to your website instead of the botpress.cloud website. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how you can do exactly that. I'll show you how you can get your bot full screened in your own website. Let's dive on in. The first thing we want to do is make the bot talk first. There's no point in having a full screen chat interface if there's no chatting going on. So just like the last video in this series, we will start with a new trigger. That's a right click here and then go to trigger and we can select a conversation started trigger and hook it up to our main flow. This is what makes the bot talk first. Hey, editing Gordy here. I forgot to mention that you need to publish your bot after you make these changes. That's all the bot building that we're doing. Next, we want to go into our documentation and copy some code. We'll scroll down from website customization all the way down to full screen chatbot. And we have some code that we get here. I'm going to copy this whole thing, go into my website and just paste it right on top of everything else. All right, this is almost done, but we still need to change the code to have our bot ID and our client ID, as well as any CSS or any styling that we want to do as well. My favorite way to get a bot's bot ID and client ID is actually in the admin panel. If we go to integrations and the configurable, we see in these settings that the bot ID is right here. I'll copy that. And our client ID is down here. Great. Finally, let's clean up some of the comments up here and give our bot a name. And we should be ready to go. I'll save this. And now our bot is full screen in our website and sends the first message. This was super easy and the code is all in our documentation. So it's just a simple copy and paste. As always, there will be a link in the description to our Discord server where this tutorial is hosted and you can download this bot as well as this website in case you need it for your own personal projects. And while you're working on your personal projects, join us in some of the other Discord channels. There's a lot of great experts like me and other people there to help you with your bot questions and give feedback or just generally hang out with. It's a great server and I hope you guys make an appearance there. And until next time, happy bot building.